It was afternoon. Due to the rain, the wind was blowing. Mother asked Salman to buy vegetables from the market, so he jumped on his bicycle and went to the market. Salman was an obedient and well-behaved son of his parents. Mother. Man and an would fulfill every order that came out of Abu's mouth. On the way to the market, Salman got tired of riding his bicycle, so he stopped the bicycle and sat on a bench under a tree to slow down for a while. Suddenly he saw the old wallet which was in a better condition. Salman started thinking that he would take this wallet and give it to his younger sister Mariam. She had asked her mother many times to get the wallet. Picked up the wallet, blew and dusted it, and was stunned when he opened it. In this purse, there was a gold necklace and a lot of jewellery. He was very happy but a sense of responsibility arose in his mind and after thinking for a while he decided to deliver the purse to the owner. After waiting for a while, he put his wallet in his pocket and left for the market. He had just gone a little further when Salman saw a worried old woman who was crying while searching for something on the way. Suspected that maybe the purse belonged to the same old lady. Salman stopped the bicycle near her and stood respectfully and inquired. Why is Amma crying? What is missing? The old woman wiped her tears and replied, Hey! Little children, my son is sick. I was going to sell household goods to cure her, but due to trouble, I lost my wallet, I am just looking for it. He inquired from the old man and said, What was in this purse? Hearing this, signs of hope and hope appeared on the old man's face. He quickly replied, Son, all the things that I got in my dowry were sold one by one, but one necklace was left which I was going to sell, but it was lost, done. When Salman was completely sure that he had found the real owner of the necklace, he took out his wallet from his pocket and said to the old woman, Amanji, look at this purse, isn't it? Hearing this, the old woman raised her eyes and started crying and praying for Salman. Salman was also very happy that now his son will be treated. He went to the market with the old woman. He was about to reach the market when a person called Salman and told him that he had reached the hospital. Your father. John has had an accident. Hearing this, he started crying and told the old woman everything. The old woman also went to the hospital with Salman because her son was also undergoing treatment there. On reaching the hospital, it was learned that the doctors told them that the condition of Salman's Abujan was out of control and he would have an operation. It will cost one lakh rupees. Salman was worried about where he got so much money from. Salman was in trouble. He couldn't understand anything. So the old woman spoke. Take this son, sell this necklace and get your father treated. It can't be too late now. Your father's life is more precious than my son's because you fulfilled your duty by giving me my wallet. The old woman's necklace and jewellery were sold for two larks, with which Salman got his father treated and the rest of the money was given to his mother, and her son's treatment was also arranged. In this way, both their lives were saved. Goodwill and goodness are rewarded.